So recently there has been talk of death lately. Someone in a group that I am in called the Cult of Dusty passed away the other day by an overdose. Some people believe it was because of suicide because she suffered from depression, but some other people who have talked to her family and friends uh, believe otherwise, but I'm not exactly sure. She was found dead at around 6 a.m. the other day from an overdose, as I stated. We're not 100% certain if it was suicide or not. Even though she did suffer from depression and had a lot of issues that people have been telling me and I've seen on the group and on a wall and everything, but I'm not exactly sure. Um, I, I don't know. I'm going to be informed later, but I don't know. It's sad to hear about someone's death. It's sad to hear when somebody passes away or commits suicide or anything. It's sad. Basically, my message to everybody in this video and everybody else out there is whether you're gay, straight, Christian, atheist, Buddhist, Muslim, it doesn't matter. All that matters is right here and right now. Don't wait till somebody passes to tell somebody your feelings or to pour your heart out on them. It means nothing now when the person is dead. Whatever you have to say to anybody, it doesn't matter if they're depressed or not. Say it now. Right here, right now. Because that's the only chance you ever get. Because that person could be gone. Like that. As long as you say it now, it will mean something. Because right now we are here, we are alive, we are conscious. But our consciousness only lasts for so long. Let's face it. When we die, that's it. There is no afterlife, no heaven, no hell, no limbo, no purgatory, nothing. Just nothingness. When you die, it's as if you were never born. That's a fact. It may not be the most pleasant thing to hear, but it's true. It's fact. The truth is never pleasant to hear, but it has to be told. Everything that we are, everything that I am, everything that you are, is from our brain. All of our emotions, all of our thoughts, everything about us is in our brain. We, we know, know this. this. And most people don't even understand this. They think we have souls, and we don't. But if something happens to us that affects our brain, just the slightest of way, our entire personality can drastically change. When our consciousness is gone, when our brain ceases to be, when our brain ceases to work, when it's done, when our heart stops and our brain stops and our brain cells start to die, that's it. We're done. And most people don't even understand this, and it's sad. But there is no heaven after we die, so why not make Earth the only place that we have, the only time we can, our heaven? Because no matter how much you wish to be, no matter how much you want it to be so, reality is reality. There is no afterlife. Death is inevitable. Death is the end. All good things must come to an F, and life, no matter what you say, is good. When we die, our consciousness ceases to exist. It's gone. Forever. And everything that makes us who we are, as I said, is our brain. And once it goes, we go. That's the plain, simple truth.